Intermittent self-catheterization is performed by inserting a catheter, which is a tube to drain the urine, into the urethral opening and advancing it through the urethra into the bladder to allow the bladder to empty. Only people who know the correct technique for proper insertion and how to use the catheter should perform this procedure. Welcome to this Hollister Education Instruction video on how to use the Vapro Plus Pocket Catheter to empty your bladder. This method of catheter insertion can be used for all catheters in the Vapro catheter portfolio. You have been advised by your healthcare professional to start using intermittent catheterization to treat your bladder dysfunction. Before opening the packaging of the Vapro Plus Pocket Catheter, you need to read the instructions for use that are included in every box. Remember to always follow the instructions that you have received from your healthcare professional. Now let's start. Make sure to have the following items prepared. Soap and water to wash your hands and the urethral opening, or if required, non-alcoholic wet wipes for urethral cleansing. This will depend on your healthcare professional's instructions. Towel and waste bin. And last but not least, your Vapro Plus pocket catheter. We recommend that you perform this procedure in a clean environment. Please note, you do not need to wear gloves when using the Vapro Plus Pocket Catheter. After you have washed your hands, you can open the Vapro Plus Pocket Catheter package. This can be done by inserting your thumb in the finger hole or placing your fingers at the top of the strip and tearing downwards along the side of the package. Once the package is open, you can remove the catheter from the package. With the collection bag facing up, hold the catheter in one hand while pushing the bag away from the catheter with the other hand to break the paper band. The Vapro Plus Pocket Catheter with 100% no-touch protection is still sterile outside of the package due to the cap that keeps the protective tip sterile and the protective sleeve that covers the catheter. Now you can touch the catheter anywhere. Before you insert the Vapro Plus Pocket Catheter into your urethra, please make sure that you follow the next steps. Wash your hands. Find a comfortable position. Some men prefer to stand for the procedure, but it can be done just as easily in the sitting position. Manipulate your clothing to access your genitalia. Lift your penis using your non-dominant hand and retract your foreskin, unless circumcised. Clean your glands penis and around your urethral opening as instructed by your healthcare professional or IFU. Now you are ready to use the Vapro Plus Pocket Catheter. Take the catheter. Unfold the integrated urine collection bag to enable the urine to flow into the bag. Remove the cap from the protective tip of the catheter. Advance the catheter into the protective tip, ensuring that it does not protrude. Grasp the catheter with your dominant hand below the protective tip plate and insert the protective tip until the base comes into contact with the urethral opening. Even though you have cleaned your genitalia, research has shown that microbes are present in the first 15 millimeters of the distal urethra. By using the protective tip of the Vapro catheters, you bypass these microbes, reducing the possibility of transporting them through the remainder of the urethra and into the bladder, which may increase the risk of urinary tract infection. After you have inserted the protective tip in your urethra as advised, you can hold the protective tip in place with the thumb and forefinger of your non-dominant hand holding your penis, pointing it in a slight upward direction. This helps to extend the urethra and can make it easier to insert the catheter. Start to insert the catheter in short incremental pushes that allow the catheter to gently move up the urethra into the bladder. You can steady the catheter by putting pressure on the barrel whilst you move your hand to insert further. Continue inserting the catheter until urine starts to flow. At some point, you may think that you have hit a barrier as it becomes difficult to insert the catheter further. If so, relax, take some deep breaths, or give a slight <sighs> cough and continue to gently insert the catheter. If you do not succeed after following these tips, 
stop the procedure and contact your healthcare professional. As the catheter enters the bladder, you will see urine flow into it. Continue to hold it in place. Observe the urine draining into the integrated collection bag, making sure that the bag is supported as it fills. Once urine flow has stopped, slowly withdraw the catheter. If urine flows again, pause until it stops. Once you're sure the bladder is empty, remove the catheter completely. Replace your foreskin, unless circumcised. After fully withdrawing the catheter, hold the collection bag by the handle. To empty the bag, tear it at the arrow labelled Tear Here to Empty. Drain urine into a toilet or other receptacle. Dispose of the catheter and any other material in a waste bin. Wash your hands and readjust your clothing. Don't flush any materials down the toilet. Thank you for watching this video. For any questions, concerns or information, please contact your healthcare professional.